many human beings. How's it going? If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. So today is just like a, well, firstly today I am running very, very behind. I left two hours later than I wanted to because I didn't charge A, GoPro batteries, B, headphone batteries, and C, Garmin batteries. That's right yesterday, but my hamstrings all week have been absolutely terrible. I've been absolutely blasting the exercise, the gym, everything. I was on like a 13 day streak or something and my body was just like, no. So I took a few days off, lost my, uh, my Apple Watch challenge with my mate Ben, but yeah, whatever. Um, went to the Cathlon yesterday, see what the new Dan Rison shop was about. Picked up these lovely, lovely bib shorts to test out. If there's one thing you're gonna spend money on, spend it on bib shorts. Yeah, so I've got the new bib shorts on. They already feel so much better than what I've had. Been running on DHB bib shorts for however long. And obviously I'm constantly wearing this map jersey, mainly because all my other jerseys, as you saw at the end of the last video, they just fall apart and disintegrate. Whereas I had this one, which is the first one I ever bought, along with the, uh, the burgundy version of this, very inexpensive in a sale, just lasting the test of time. No stretching, no bowing, no elastic coming out. You can't buy it anymore, but I'm assuming that all map jerseys are built the same. But yeah, so today we're going to Windsor on my own, train and ride. I'm gonna try and get a bit of pace in there because I've had five, six days off. I'm not running the chest mount today, I'm running the, uh, the vlogger's mouth grip just so I could be a bit more uh, concentrating on all the footage I get, rather than just getting hell loads of chest footage and being lazy. But yeah, enjoy. It's gonna be a good one. Let's go. down too much. It was cradling me in the wrong places. But I wasn't gonna stop for a coffee, but now I have a coffee. So I've got a new bike coming soon. I'm thoroughly regretting not getting it in white. Yes, yeah. exact yeah. reason. <laughs> intentional coffee break just to sort out my uh, my saddle we're now back on the bike after staring at some guy's raptor that is not a euphemism um, realizing that the new frame I'm getting I kind of wish I just got it in pure white but maybe for the next one we left the calf now we're pushing on next stop Windsor Let's go. My brow is sweating. I've got so much sweat on my glasses, it's nuts. And the sun's gone. <laughs> and I'm alone. <laughs> 26 miles in. I haven't spoken for a little bit or recorded for a little bit because obviously the mouth mount makes you uh, basically record a little bit less because it's getting it out, etc. Um, yeah, and the wind is uh, something different today. So I had to concentrate on just like getting through <laughs> and pushing through the headwind. Which is still here, but not as uh, it's not as strong. I remembered why I don't use this saddle anymore. My ass is in bits, <sighs> but I'm really glad I'm out. I'm starting to 
salt sweat a bit. So far, I feel fantastic. It's my, uh, I said before, like my hamstrings is a bit, a bit off. They're just like super tight. And I don't really understand why they're so tight. Because it's been like a week. I've given a week since, uh, well, a week of rest pretty much. And then anything legs at all. Just like when I'm picking my weight up maybe at the gym. But yeah, hamstrings are tight. Bum's killing me from this shoddy saddle. But I had to change it because of the way that there's no pressure relief channel. So it's not as good as the other one. But look, we found a perfect fop moment. I'm gonna slow down, take some pictures here. sprint the whole way back i feel like i got my legs back my hamstrings are still a little bit uh i wouldn't say tight just they don't exist that much um but it's definitely feeling better i think the last week on the on the via ride i think it was just cramping the hamstrings and then just kept going kept going kept pushing kept pushing i think this might have strained them a little bit to be honest definitely good to have an extra day off but other than that i feel great Average pace up 17 miles an hour, which is nice considering that, like I came here on a headwind and I'm returning on a headwind. But yeah, let's continue. Absolutely gorgeous. Bloody delightful. So embarrassing notion. I did quite I did well at that little hill, but I dropped my bloody gel at the start, didn't I? Yeah. No second gel for me. The entire thing just slipped out of my hand. And a car ran over it straight after me. So no gel. There's definitely a lot less people than I thought there would be. Like I didn't think there was gonna be many because obviously it's a Monday and it was I like, left the house at like 20 past or 10 past 10, 20 past 10. But there were so many less people than I thought. I was really hoping for some draft. Either on the way there or on the way back. But I wasn't uh, graced with the presence, let's say. I was doing it on my own. I lost the sun headwind my ass hurts <laughs> but I don't think it's due to the to my new bib shorts I think it's literally just due to the, the fact that I got this crap seat on
is the one. Oh, bag it. Eyes up. People are dumb. People are very, very dumb. I feel like I should, just, I should just go into them from now on. Maybe. I must enjoy one little underpass can give you. And it's such a nice aesthetic. I do rather enjoy it. Pretty great lash, hey, let's go. <laughs> Alright ladies and gents. My, uh, my legs are, I've, I've muted the group chat, they're about to leave. Um, so I'm gonna sign off and say goodbye. I just wanna thank you all for watching. None of you need to see me go and take an Epsom bath. So anyway, it's been absolutely beautiful. The weather's not been amazing. The speed's been all right, but you've all been fantastic. Peace and love. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Probably wait until my Garmin's given me all my stats and stuff before signing out. That was my fastest 40k. Did not see that coming, but I'm pretty gassed. But again, thank you for watching. See you next one. Peace and love. Peace.